Hi, and welcome back to today's more report on Monday, the twentieth of April, with me, Chipotle Market and Leicester Hand Tech Markets. Moving on to cable now, and cable is a very interesting chart at the moment because it's on the brink of a breakout, uh, of an upside bullish breakout. Um, it tried on Friday, breaking above the um, one fifty key resistance. Uh, he actually spent quite a lot of Friday above one fifty, then sold off into the afternoon to actually leave um, not a bearish candle but certainly isn't a positive one uh, you had a gain on the day but you could argue it's even potentially a, a small shooting star but I mean it's not a perfect one because it's got a, a bullish um, sort of head to it however uh, that makes today's um, candle even more interesting because if today's candle now starts to close lower then you could argue that uh, it is actually a bearish move that we could start to see this um, this resistance band holding once again um, although you do start to question the fact that it, it did it did actually reach a high of um, of quite a, uh, I think it's 53 uh, if my crosshair works which it, yes it does 50 53 uh, we got a, a high on Friday so it's quite a long way above that 50 resistance um, and it sort of continues these well you've had four strongly bullish candles in a row that's not necessarily such a bullish candle um, it does lead to a few questions as to uh, the the validity of the breakout, but certainly the, m the momentum is more positive than it has been uh, for about six weeks on both Stochastics, well, Stochastics, MACD and also RSI. So that sort of suggests that it is starting to try and move out. But on the hourly chart, you do have this slight sort of consolidation. Um, th there is more of a pronounced head and shoulders top, I think, on Euro dollar. Um, potentially on the hourly chart than it has on on sterling because sterling is sort of more of a consolidation phase I think although you do still have if I zoom out here you do have um, this sort of drift away of the MACD lines and the RSI so it's it is um, I think in a, in a bit of a, a wait and see mode I think you the fact that cables found support on that 55 hour moving average again in the last couple of hours is a is a positive um, and I think you'd certainly be looking out for that reaction low that we had on Friday at about around 49.20 as your sort of initial support and that's 50 pips away from where we are now um, so it's still a fair bit of room to play around with um, but certainly I think at the moment there's just more of a consolidation look to cable um, than it there is on the euro dollar which looks more corrective and uh, euro continues to underperform sterling in these last few weeks so um yeah some uh, interesting an interesting moment i think for cable it's it's more of a wait and see i think um at the moment because this, as i said it, this could turn out into a to be a little top pattern and also the fact that you're up around this uh, 150 pivot uh, sorry this 150 resistance that had been so often causing the um the resistance there in the last few weeks um it's sort of I mean also with that shooting star arguably it's, it's a lot there's a lot of sort of gray area technicals at the moment that uh, you might want to see resolved before you I think pick a direction on this chart so just be careful on cable I think um, in the very near term anyway I wish you good luck in your trading on cable and I will speak to you later thank you